Uh, I grew up in China, and my father is a sailor. He has been worked on the ships for more than 20 years. After I finished my high school, he asked me to go abroad and study. He told me that there were three options, Denmark, USA, and the UK. And he said Denmark is a safe country, especially for young girls at 19 years old. So I just came here for study. The program I chose is called Environmental Engineering. I chose this program because I think China began to put more focus on environmental problems in the future, and it is more and more popular. For me, it's easier to get a job if I get a lot of advanced uh, technology here in Denmark and back to China. That's why I chose this program. Uh, I have met a lot of challenges here in Denmark. The first thing I should say is language. Danish people have their own language, which is called Danish, and it's very different from Chinese. I should say the pronunciation is very difficult for our Chinese people. But finally, after eight years, I have learned this language, and I can do daily communication with Danish people, no problem. The best thing I experienced here in Denmark is uh, the academic uh, knowledge. SDTU is a top-ranked university, and a lot of new softwares and technologies have been developed here. I think it's very good that I can bring those new technologies and uh, good solutions to China to solve our own environmental problems. For Chinese students, I think the worst thing is group work. Because when I was in China, I used to study alone, I mean individual work. But uh, after I came to Denmark, I realized that for each course, we had a lot of group work. I think it's a very good challenge for Chinese students. I will advise Chinese students to practice their English before they come to Denmark because Danish people, they are not very good at Chinese, but they are very good at English. And the other thing is don't be afraid of Danish people. They are bigger, taller, but they are very friendly and you will get warm welcome.